We are not helpless victims. Mm -hmm. We are not passive victims, and we don't want to be. Uh, the, the, uh, the fallacy of this is that people see violence only when Palestinians resort to violence. And as you know, any people under occupation by international law have the, the right to resist in every possible way through the international law. But still, Israel exercises violence on Palestinians daily. It daily kills Palestinians, daily it demolishes homes, daily it arrests people. And yet the narrative is the other way around. Israel is portraying <laughs> itself as the victim. Exactly. Here. You see, so that's how do you, why. How do you switch that narrative? The distortion of the narrative how do you and the, the lack of knowledge of the power asymmetry have created two distortions and unrealistic views of what's happening on the ground. This has to be switched by, by uh, public diplomacy, by, by a clear policy, by clear strategies. But more importantly, and by this emerging network of solidarity, the protest marches, hundreds of thousands, people came out and said, this is wrong. It's time to stop the injustice exercised against the Palestinians and to stop the pain.